three goals in his last. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Nottingham Forest versus Arsenal. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Martinelli. Can he play it in? Well shown inside. Oh, great block. He's foiled them on his own. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, it's a 4 5 1, but with three of the midfield players giving close support to the centre forward and the other two sitting deeper. Also, watch out for the fullbacks getting forward at every opportunity. They do like to get crosses into the box. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Well, a heightened sense of anticipation. I say that because it's his very first game for the club. Well, I'm expecting to show us his talent today because he has all the attributes needed to beat defenders. And most... Real chance. Without putting too fine a point on it, he really should have put that away. Well, that should have been the opening goal, no doubt about that. But it's a wasteful finish. And this is the Arsenal starting eleven. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Thomas Partey starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the striker today is Viktor Osimhen. Well, I believe a spot kick award in one of the other games. Let's hear all about it from Alex. Yes, it was a penalty for Villa. And the technique was just all wrong with that one. Shot well over. It remains nil-nil with 19 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. And the keeper there to deal with it. And taken short. Martinelli. And here's Partey. And that's really well read. Ibrahim Songare. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Well, coordinated pressing and a poor clearance. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Martinelli. Now, who can he pick out? Oh, a goal! Well, maybe we shouldn't be surprised. They were asking for trouble with their passive approach. 1-0 then. Number 13, Victor Osimhen. And in with a real chance. Can he put it in? And there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes. Incredible stuff. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Dominguez. Murillo. And Alex is going to tell us about a goal that's been scored at Villa Park. It's a goal for Newcastle. They've scored the opener here with 37 minutes played. Thanks for the update, Alex. Martin Odegaard. Martinelli. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Giovanni Reina. And threading it through. Will he find the net? And the goalkeeper's touch. That was crucial. Well, these fans can sense an opportunity here. They need to make the most of this corner. Delivering it. Any goalkeeper would accept corner kick deliveries like that every day. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. That is that. Yeah. 
So the ball moving. The pendulum has already swung Arsenal's way in this game. Will we see more of the same in the second half? And a change to the scoreline in the Wolves game, I'm hearing. Let's get the news from Alex. It's a second goal for Wolves. Nice build-up play, and when the space opened up, boy, did he take it well. They're back in this now with 47 minutes played. Thank you, Alex. Well, many have wondered if they would get it over the line in terms of the deal. They've succeeded, Stuart. Well, I think it's a good move for him. He has great ability, but needs... And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. So back with the action, and Arsenal sprinting away with ease. Morgan gives White... Cross could be useful. Struggling to get it away. Gibbs White. Cuts it back. He's blocked it. Martinelli. Alexander Zinchenko. It's with Erdogan. Determined defending. Jacob Ramsey and we have more live Premier League action coming up for you soon on EA TV it's Nottingham Forest facing Bournemouth real chance well hit with ferocity when accuracy was required. Well, they've decided to make a change. Alexander Zinchenko. And a throw coming up after a really fine piece of tackling. Thomas Partey. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Andrew Vance, but Andrew Vance, please meet your wife. Thank you. Now a decent position. Oh, the referee has given it. Penalty it is. And he puts it away confidently. Underway again with the score at 3-1. And into the last 20 minutes. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV. And we have more action coming up from the Premier League for you. It's Arsenal taking on Liverpool. Right, I'm just hearing in my ear there's been a goal at Villa Park. That means we send it over to Alex Scott. It's a second goal for Aston Villa. The game's all level again at 2-2 with 76 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Tommy Yasu. They do pass the ball with authority. Ozim Hen. Real chance. And pretty straightforward in the end. Ten minutes to go. Marcinelli. Just not looking confident in possession. Oh, great vision. Well, that's how to outwit your opponent. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Ozim Hen. And it's with Gibbs White. Ibrahim Songare. It's there for him. Oh, another goal! You just cannot keep them down. And it sets up a furious finish. Gabriel Tomiyasu well, You can absolutely sense the frustration growing in the opposition camp They can't get near the ball So there it is, the final whistle And a satisfying outcome for Arsenal And the many fans around the world What did you think of their performance as a whole?
Well, Derek, it was... Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match.